Hello everyone, Circle here, and I'm here with another showdown live. This time I'm doing something a bit different. Um, this is, I think it, <laughs> Step Month, which is um, Step Month. Pokemon can have any attack of their that is like the same as their typing, uh, even if they don't learn it. Combined with almost any ability, which means I can just change abilities to whatever I want. And I made this really interesting team. It's like, this is a really, really fun meta because it's like, really has you be really creative with what you make. So I have a choice packs Primordial Sea and Zepdos with Weather Ball, which becomes a water type because the Primordial Sea. Thunder always hits because of the Primordial Sea. And Oblivion Wing. Which um, is Kipelto's move, which is really really good. Um, I have Cresselia here as my spit F wall, this thing like insane spit F. Uh, also insane defense, but like still. And I have this really interesting set. I have Teleport Toxic with Corrosion, which means I can poison anything, uh, even steel types coming in, and then Moonblast Moonlight leftover. Um, there are like a lot of Cresselias with other sets running around. Uh, Poison Wheel is a common one I know. But I really just wanted to use Corrosion because the Celeso is such a cool Pokemon and its ability is such an interesting thing. I have Garchomp with um, Adaptability Dragon Dance Dragon Darts and then Earthquake Stone Edge. Which this sets of a Dragon Dance with its Sash still intact and just decimates things. It's really ridiculous. And like you can see uh, all the abilities here are available which is interesting like we have S1 um, and Beast Boost and stuff like that. It's really interesting. Um, I have Zarud which this is Compe but then physical. It has Drain Punch, Horn Leech, uh, Bulk Up and Strength Zap and the Triage um, Three of these four moves acceptable hook get priority, and um, the speed is very specific because it outspeeds um, Adamant Rillaboom this way. Rillaboom has a tendency to also run triage, so then I can outspeed that and um, then kill it with Drain Punch, which is very nice. Uh, I have a Shifu Rapid style, which um, one of my friends um, gave me this uh, deck. Which is Technician with Flip Turn and Surging Strikes. Um, Surging Strikes is ridiculous. I'm gonna be taking it almost every time. It does so much damage. Uh, Flip Turn, of course, gives me priority. It's 90 base power with Technician, I believe. Yep, 90 base power. And then I have Ice Punch specifically for Guard Jump and um, Thunderous Kick because it lowers defense. And if since I'm Scarf, that can really help. And one thing that's really common is weather, which Zapdos counted three of the four weathers. Um, and rain, I have Megana for. Assault Fest Water Absorb, which is really handy. I can switch this in on my phones that want to water spout or something. And I have Fleur Cannon Full Switch Ice Beam, but then Anchor Salt over Iron Head. It has the same base power, but the trapping is really, really nice. So, this is like a really fun team. And like this whole meta is really fun and creative and let's just see what we can find on the ladder. Alright, this looks very annoying to deal with because Amoongus and Phoebe. Uh, my guard jump looks really good late game. I am gonna lead Zepdos because it leads well for basically everything. I can Oblivion wing the Amoongus. Which it's not gonna take well. Uh huh. Take an answer up here. Corrosive gas. There went. That was the end of my focus ash. He's prankster. What I'm gonna actually do is bulk up here.
Because, like, I'm immune to Prankster, he, he does go Zephyrus on me. Uh, I can throw uh, Flur Cannon here into a full switch. And I go Zephyrus and I click Weather Ball here. And I killed the. He's Water Absorb Heat then. Alright, noted. Huh. Doom Desire. Oh my god. Uh, let me. Flip turn here. But yeah, because. He wouldn't expect me to stay in here. And we go back in Sarut. I take the Doom Desire and I Strength Zap here. We'll do the Zapdos, yep. As he U turns. I'm gonna toxic this heat run. Give me this. No. Take that. I'm gonna DD again here. And I'm gonna Dragon Darts and just kill it. And I'm gonna DD on you as he supports me and I wake up and I kill the Zapdos yes that's what I'm talking about and now he just loses to the root which he wanted to avoid <laughs> I love how I got the toxic on the heat then Doom Desire is really interesting but like uh, it's not as effective and this guard jump set is just so powerful. Oh, we have Bolt Beak. Um, Bolt Beam. This. My Zerud is looking really good late game. I'm actually gonna lead Cresselia. And I'm gonna Moonblast here. He should know he can't one shot me. He really just. Alright, we go Magena here. And I full switch. Into the heat van. We go Urshifu. We click Thunderous Kick. As he just switches out to Toxapex. Alright, alright. He flip turns with the Toxapex, but I'm in Zapdos now. My guard jump is also like really good. I just need to watch out for Reggie Lucky. Which my AV McGinna also really works for. And I moonlight up here. And I toxic something. The good thing about any this is Chansey doesn't run um, natural cure, which means toxics are a whole lot more useful. I toxic the Toxapex, alright. I moonlight and I teleport. A toxic on the Toxapex is really useful.
I also, uh, if I go guard jump, I can just literally click EQ, um, raw, which is nice. He does go Chansey, which I can teleport out on this. I feel like he's gonna be like fluffy or something. Um, I'm gonna go Garchomp here. Uh, on what I'm expecting now to be Regiadeki. Uh huh. Nah. -uh. And I pull switch on the heat and into Garchomp. And I click Earthquake. If he's levitate, that's also fine. Because, yep. That's a whole of a lot of damage. And I dragon darts here. And I killed the Reggie Alecky. That's also really really good. I feel like this is Levitate. So I'm gonna Dragon Dance and Stone Edge him here. And Dragon Darts will get the KO here. Magena, I can Earthquake. Yep. Chansey, I don't think he will take this well and he just forfeits. Because this Guard Jump is just too strong. Um, this is like a very common Reggie Alecky with um, Refrigerate on extreme speed just to deal with Ice Type. But um, again, I can take that very well and I have Zerud, which actually he, it would outspeed that because Triage and Extreme Speed are the same. Um, priority. So, I think I played like the Cresselia very well. The Toxic on Toxic Effect was really annoying to him. So, Ooh, we found a game really, really fast. Uh, Incineroar, Mew. Mew is also a scary one because it doesn't have a good ability usually. Um, <laughs> Cresselia. You click Toxic. He's just gonna set up hazards here. I, I just know it. Yep. He is... Poison heal. Alright. That sucks. I'm gonna just flirt in here. He doesn't really have a switch in to Floor Cannon, except like his Magena. That took a decent chunk, honestly. Actually, my Zerud is like really good here late game, uh, except like Zapdos and Magena. Um, I'm gonna teleport there. Excuse you, no, 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 no. You get out of here. Nice. Also, whatever he brings in is gonna eat one food. Um, I'm just gonna click it. I don't have to think about this. Um, are you fake out? He is, by the way, just intimidate, which. Interesting choice to say the least. I'm gonna drag an answer up in his face. I'm gonna click Dragon Darts. So Punch shouldn't be able to kill me. And we do get the knockout there. And at this point, like Magena dies, uh, Gartum dies, and Zapdos, I'm pretty sure, also dies. Magena will take this Earthquake. Yep. Zepdos will take a stone edge, and that's basically everything I needed out of the way. He is scarfed. Interesting. 
I'm gonna go my own Zapdos and click Weather Ball here. And I will take down his own. And I hope he goes Gertrude here. Because if I get a hit on that, I just win. Alright, that's also fine. Uh, I'm gonna horn eat you. I see soft boys. Alright, Magana. You anchor shot the Mew. And he's stuck here with me. I think I have to keep clicking Anchor Shot there. We broke up again and then we horn leech. And I actually might have it there. Because I don't think Gartrum can kill me. Um, if it's not Sash, it might actually just die. 75, 75, um, just on each end because it's stab, and that doesn't matter because he thinks he can outspeed me with the giant dance, but I'm too much. So that was a very close game. Actually, the root really showing how good it is, which I'm really happy that happened. Um, that's exactly why I wanted this set. Hmm, this looks kind of scary. He does. Yeah, still have Libero, because why wouldn't he? Um, I'm kind of tempted to lead for Shifu. Because it works versus everything except um, the Regieleki. And the Searching strikes him and kill him. Which warrants probably switching to either Magena, Clefable or Regieleki. Hello? Yes, he has, he has S1. Oh my god. <laughs> that, that's kind of low key terrifying. As he just forfeits, he didn't think I was Scarf. Geo 9, 3, 3, 3, I believe. So that, that's fair. But <laughs> that's kind of funny. He has Bulu. Hmm, my Zerud still looks like really good there. I am gonna leave my Urshifu. And if he leads Regieleki, I'm gonna make a big brain play and I'm gonna just searching strikes. Because he has to, I think he's gonna, um, Try to hit my um, Gartum coming in. He doesn't. Alright. Noted. Wait. Hold up. What? I outspeed him. I'm gonna go Magana here. That's literally just a free full switch for me.
He is grassy terrain though, which is really interesting. I get a Vulture on the Tux Packs. I get an Earthquake on the... Uh, he's actually smart with the terrain. I'm gonna double to Magena on a flip turn. But because... Oh, I Water Absorbed it. I'm gonna Anchor Shot here. You're not going anywhere. Alright. Um, I'm gonna Volt Switch. Uh, go Cresselia. He is Urshifu Rapid Strike. Um, which I can Moonblast you. Because this doesn't kill me. Guaranteed. And Zarud! My ready. Horn leech this. I feel like it's choice ban Tapu Bulu. Yep, Flurkanen, which um, just allows me to full switch here again. On the Chansey actually, which is very nice. Um, I'm just gonna Earthquake. Yeah, because he's gonna get out of here into Tapu. No. Out of here. And I go Guard Chomp, and I throw off another Earthquake, and I kill the Pex, which is nice. Um, Bulu is still really scary. I'm gonna double Dragon Darts here. Damn! <laughs> if I was Poison Jab, I could hit this too, which is annoying, to be fair, but um, I can handle this. My Horsepower doesn't affect me. Um, do I Oblivion Wing here? I think I Weather Ball here. Magena doesn't take that well. And he should fear me going back into Magena. He actually doesn't. And we full switch again. AV McGinna is just so solid because it gets to um, eat hits for free. And we weather ball. This is regenerator. And. He does grassy glide again, but I get a bolt switch off here. Actually, I get an anchor shot off here. Into something. And I think, actually, that my Zerud can win here. If I get like a bulk up on the Chansey, let me Volt Switch here. Guard Jump, Earthquake this. That's still a ton of damage. Earthquake it again. Even through the terrain it did 62. Alright, we get rid of Magena, which is huge. Because now... I think I win. I, because I can get let this go down here. I don't have to care.
And then Zarut comes in and gets to kill this and everything else with Horn Leech. And if he switches to Bula, I even get the terrain boost, so. I think this is just done. Alright, so the last guy, um, the one um, that I said lost to Zarut, he left and he didn't come back. Probably because he left, to, he lost to Zarut. Um, which Zarut again looks really, really good. Probably something with rain. Uh, but, uh, I'm gonna lead my Urshifu and just click Surgeon Strike. And that's an Jaspon. Yes, she does have the web, but um. Oh. Oh no, buddy. No, 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 no. And we Earthquake here. He pulled the guys to me, but I do have my Sash. Um, which means I can always kill him. And this forces him, yep, into Revile. I'm just gonna let him knock me out there. With Glacial Lands? Ooh, that's kind of clean, actually. Urshifu! Surging Strikes here. I'm gonna Surging Strikes you too. I'm not gonna let you set up here. Yep. I'm gonna force you to do that, and then I can Moonblast here with my Cresselia. As he misses Bone Meringue, which sucks, but... And I Moonlight there. How much did Moonblast do? I'm just gonna Moonblast him again. Yeah, no. Get out of my face. And we Toxic him here. Clanger of Soul? Oh my god. Yes, Poison Heal, wait! I lost! I lost, I straight up lost. I lost, thanks, have you? Yep. Actually, yeah, I, I think I just straight up lost. Oh my god. That's Loki really, really cool. I, I can't even lie. I don't mind losing to this as much. That That's awesome. Alright, uh, we got another game. Oh, wait. We, we fought this guy, early, guy earlier. Alright. I'm gonna leave Cresselia this time, as he still would have allowed me to just lead Urshifu and beat him up. See, let me teleport there. And he gives me Reggie Alecky. I don't get it, but alright. And Megena and Clefable, I both just have Megena for, so. I'm gonna click Ice Beam here. Expected him to um, go to uh, Lando. He goes Cinderace, which all right. What if I go Zephyrus on this and just click Water Ball? Yep. No, I'm immune to that, and I just Water Ball here. He has nothing to switch into it. 
he has a wider Pungena, which isn't AV, so it's not bulky enough. And it Iron Hats my Zapdos. And it flinches! <laughs> no, stop! No! What? Break two, please. Thank you. <laughs> that was kind of mean. <laughs> he rock slides me. I go Garchomp. I bang dance in his face. And I Dragon Darts. And he dies. And now I get chip on Clefable or Magina, which then um, I can just certain strikes. Yep. Oh, I just kill Clefable, that's also fine. I'm curious what they did with Spectre Loki. It's just the better ability. That doesn't help you much. Yeah, you still just die. And I get to Earthquake this. Alright, that's Garchomp just being Garchomp. Oh, this guy again. Honestly, I just Dragon Dodge here. Yep, and he goes into his V-Pile. Which is then a free Ice Beam for me. No! I cannot allow you to set up again. I Flur Cannon here. I Flur Cannon here. See, I should have Fortress that there. Um, Zapdos. No, and I Oblivion Wing here. I Oblivion Wing here. Ooh! As he turns out to be Queenly Majesty. And he does allow me to win. Oh my god. He actually kind of threw that because he could have just set up the Clangor's Soul again. But yeah, that his team is like really really cool. I'm gonna end it on that actually. I, I know I sped up like the last part of the battle. Um, but that was like really good. Showing that, like, actually, no, I I didn't even show anything good. He just threw that game. <laughs> but yeah, this was like really fun to record. Like Zerud and Garchomp put in a ton of work. Um, but yet I walled like every water type on the planet. Uh, really fun to do. Uh, with that, I really hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.